at nap I have to do animal crossing because somebody moved out and I need to fill the spot so I don't accidentally pick up somebody's leftover villager that they've picked out because they're never good ones. So I will be going to island after island. everyone we are out on our lunchtime walk I don't think I've talked to you yet there is one of those painted rocks right there I'll get that in a second but we just had some Panera hadn't ordered from them yet of course last week was when they gave me free bagels for a week but it doesn't really work when you're not going in there oh another rock okay I'll... <laughs> he's finding a bunch of rocks anyway today I just I've been working and working on orders for the trip, doing laundry, uh, not much else exciting. At NAP I have to do Animal Crossing because somebody moved out and I need to fill the spot so I don't accidentally pick up somebody's leftover villager that they've picked out because they're never good ones. So I will be going to island after island, hoping to find somebody good. Uh, maybe I'll film who I get so you guys can see. Um, yeah, we're gonna keep going on our walk. Just a warning, he didn't nap. I didn't give an intro to nap, thinking I would just film him sleeping blissfully and get on with my life. He didn't nap. Yeah, we tried. Did not work. He's getting a little bit to the insane belligerent stage. It is 8.17, so hoping for a really early bedtime. Anyway, my day was not great, not horrible, not great. We did take a really nice long walk together, like not far, just long. 
I stopped at every single grassy field he could run in. I stopped in all the rocky places where he could collect his favorite rocks. But he still didn't know. Um, anyway, my target order has mostly come in. I'm not holding out my hope for the beach shoes for Sebastian, but I placed an Old Navy order for some clothes for us and paid to have it shipped faster. <laughs> and one of the things in that order is toddler flip-flops. So they're not as cozy as the beach slides, but they will do. So I'm slowly getting everything prepared for the trip. I did pick out which knitting pattern I want to work on. I have all the needles and all the yarn I need. I just need to narrow down the color of the roses. It's going to have roses across here. I think it'll be really pretty. I'm not sure if I'm going to do short sleeve or long sleeve. Let's see, what else do I have to say? I do have to work tomorrow. My client, who I do the beer labels and stuff for, he sent me a bunch more t-shirt mock-ups. He's probably changing the website or something or I'm doing an email blast so I need to do a bunch of mock-ups but also another new t-shirt and I think that's it for work tomorrow so far we have a class tomorrow my toilet is running because it needs to be replaced um I don't know but I did get a new villager in Animal Crossing I had to have Jax help me out because after a failed nap I cooked dinner and I would run to the island, film whoever it was, and then hand it off to Jax and he would chop down the trees or pick the fruit or whatever so I could at least sell it on each island. So I am making the bed. It's kind of dark in here. Maybe I'll wait till I'm done talking. So yeah, he would take care of the island, which made him really happy. He would say, you're welcome, as he handed it back. Like, he forgets you gotta wait till somebody says thank you. But eventually on like island number 12 or 13 i found marina who's a pink octopus and she's super cute she's not on my keep forever list i don't think i kind of want to have all villagers with black houses i think it'd be really cool looking but for now i'm just enjoying switching it up and i'm totally happy with her and i'm pretty sure that somebody would want to adopt her i hate just letting all these people go I did run into one of my old villagers and they programmed her to actually say, hey, do I know you? Fancy seeing you here. That was the goat, Pashim, Pashmina, Pashmina. She was one of my starting villagers. But, so that's done. I was able to have somebody stop by my island and pick some stuff up. You kind of have to go into quarantine when you have an empty spot in your your island, an empty lot, because if somebody comes over and they've recently lost somebody, it's kind of floating in what we call the void, <laughs> like a cloud. And if they visit you, they get sucked into your empty lot and they will appear there and you won't get your, the choice of who goes there. So I was in lockdown today until I saw that sold sign on the plots. Anyway, I'm sure you sick of Animal Crossing after seeing all those clips, but that was really the only exciting thing today. I didn't film the walk too much because I was just enjoying being with him and choosing rocks. I can show you some of his rocks. I'm gonna show everybody some of your rocks because they're so pretty. Here's some of his rocks. And an empty pretzel bag. He was keeping them in his little bag that was mine. Are you building? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go to bed in a couple minutes. Oh gosh, you made such a mess. One like, I just cleaned them. Nobody can open the door. <laughs> I literally just cleaned that exact spot like right before I started talking to you. Anyway, I've been plugging away at these braids. So I'm first I'm replacing all the rainbow. That's the bottom half of my hair and I'm doing that gradient. So I've just been working my way around this side and now I'm starting on this side. I've done about 30 of them, and let's see. So you can see this side is done. Nice, fresh roots. Not purple yet, but old roots. <laughs> I gotta redo this part tonight. I don't know how much it is. I do about 15 a night, unless it's a weekend, then I stay up even later and do more. But hopefully he'll be to bed pretty early. I just wanna 
lay out a flower garden in Animal Crossing now that I can actually do things. The dang shirts aren't all over the place because my rock garden didn't finish. So maybe after I lay out some flowers and do this video, I will start early on this madness. And yeah, once I get all this rainbow switched out, then I will be grabbing that pile of lavenders and mixing them all up for the top part. But I just want to be done a few days before the trip. That would be ideal. I can do any extra bleaching, just probably a really light bleaching to get from this yellow one step later. And then it'll just be maintaining a lavender with lavender conditioner. That color washes out so fast for me. I could just go out in the sun and it's gone. So I do have to wash my hair more when I'm doing lavender because I have to put it in constantly. So I just want to get finished and have a couple days to do that. But that is all I have to say to you. It was a really boring one, sorry. But if you came here because you wanted to see the Animal Crossing, sorry there's no sound, I have a switch light. I cannot like screen capture, so it's just my phone. And I always have my headphones plugged in, so it was just them going <laughs> Maybe someday I can figure out a way, I don't know. My kids are too loud. I can't just record the sound as it's playing. <laughs> but yeah, hi, welcome. Thank you for watching. I hope you're staying safe and healthy at home during this pandemic. I hope you're doing something that brings you joy and I hope you're with people you love. But don't forget to wash your hands.